Welcome to another episode of uh, Life is Strange. Last episode, shit got real. Chloe's dead. God no, Chloe. Why? Why, Chloe? <laughs> oh God, dark room. All right, let's just get right into this. While the Previously intro plays, I'm strange. gonna make my yogurt. What did you find? Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. We can't trust anybody. Except each other. You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. What are you doing in my dorm? You are so fucking dead! <sighs> Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. <sighs> Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. What are you doing here, Max? Victoria has to be next. What a lame gimmick. Rachel, why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. I didn't warn her. He no, I didn't warn her. Go, it, go back. I didn't warn her. Oh God, Max, look. She's still there. Uh, don't show it. Don't show it. Oh, no. Yeah, I was drugged. Oh, don't. No, 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 no. Please, God, no. What the fuck? Oh my God, it looks like he shot her in the fucking stomach or the foot, not in the face. Fuck you, Jefferson. What, what was his first name? Mark. Fuck you, Mark Jefferson, the fifth. Be funny if that was an act, his actual name. The fifth. She got shot in the fucking head, dude. It looks like she. It, the bullet looked like it went down, not straight to her head. Oh god. Am I gonna be posing for the deep web, or the dark web? I know about that shit, guys. start this episode they start this episode strong this is some bullshit Max, wake the fuck up. Oh god, what's gonna happen to me? I'm just wearing a black shirt. Why? Hey, I can move the camera. Oh, I can move it even more. Chloe. She dead, girl. What? Where? The bunker. It's a dark room. Why? Why? <laughs> that looks like you could squeeze your hand right out of there. Help! Somebody help me! God, I don't remember anything that happened. Oh shit, that's me. He took that shot last night. Great. I can see all my things, but I can't grab it. These straps are 
hurt. About your left foot. <laughs> Something's gotta work. Of course. And right in front of me. Yes! Oh, finally, I'm free. Almost. I don't remember any. I hate looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. This angle highlights your purity, see? The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. No vanity or posing, just pure expression. You fucking perv! Look at that perfect face. Hold that stare there! Stay still! Oh, you're. You, you, I'm gonna fucking murder you. You fucked up my shot! Mm hmm But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now. I knew you were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes. I still hate that word. I'm going to fucking but murder I love you. The purity of your own image. Not like Rachel, who was always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Let me try this angle. Don't move! Oh. How did I know? How did I know it was this son of a bitch? <sighs> Much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and expect a cohesive style or theme. But he had an eye for shadows, and an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Good. Oh, those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room... Is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone. And you fell right into my hands. I You really hate should have you. focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe. Right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history, like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. I hate you. Okay. You're going to die. This looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Maybe a new dose will calm you oh, down. No. No. Now don't move or this will hurt much. Stupid! Bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, 
You might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter, though. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. No. Remember my number one rule. Always oh. take the oh. shot. Jesus. What changed? Uh. Oh, Jesus. I can't believe that happened. So sick. Picture isn't going to help. And I can't go through all that again. Wait. Jefferson couldn't handle stains on his photos. Good. Now I can use them. How? I'd really like to smash that fancy camera into Jefferson's face. Whoa. I I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. Why? This might work. Please work. Jesus. I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. <coughs> yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You I'm going to kill you. Max. I choose you. Your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? <laughs> Max. I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura. And those lucky few become my models. I my am going subjects. to murder you. Yes. You're a psychopath. And this is your last session. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. And don't get me started on your late partner. <coughs> I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. You go to hell. Go to hell. You will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike pure sweet Kate Marsh, I don't believe in that bullshit. She could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse... Blah, blah, blah. blah. God, I hate your voice now. You might as well savor it, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. <laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Too bad you already made a convincing argument against Nathan in the principal's office. Thank you so much for setting him up for me. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. He... he's as... You used Nathan. I prefer the term manipulated. Like with an image. Nathan's was easy to twist around. I became a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. 
I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access. And who do you think paid for this glorious dark room and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Chloe and Rachel. You killed both of them. They're fucking together in heaven right now. Is that what you want to hear? What? <laughs> I can't lie. I hate this dude so bad. But the fucking joke that he just made. <laughs> Fucking together in heaven right now. Why? Why? Start listening to me, you dumb cunt. Oh no, you caught me a cunt. It's over for you now. I'm sorry, Max. <laughs> that was not cool. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway. I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. I have oh, all those photos this in my diary. This, this could be a way out. Personified. Nothing. Max. I wish you. Check it out. Photos. Amazing. <laughs> You could see yourself now. I have all those photos in my oh, diary. Oh, shut up! This could be a way out. Fucking together in heaven right now. This one is out of focus, Jesus. but that's my fault, Max. What? Let's see how these shots came out. I can- Wait! Please, uh, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. I, my diary. You... you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. Oh, we've seen this shit. All right. Jesus, I'm focusing a lot here.
I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic trick. Right back where I started this insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe ever again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, <laughs> since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Who cares? Who cares? This class is hella bullshit. I'll pretend you didn't say that and let you try to answer one more. Sorry, there's no time left. I mean, your class is almost over. Oh. Well. Thanks for the warning, Max. So, the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. Clearly, Max doesn't have the, uh, time. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. Time to change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, artwork. let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. All I need is David's number, and Jefferson is one text closer to life without parole. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Found you. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. The past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? No shit. It doesn't matter what happens to me. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh. Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? I, don't I can give see a you're fuck. kissing ass again. Nothing new. What did you just say? Hold on, Victoria. Yeah, boy. Are you okay, Max? Not until Victoria knows that hiding behind a screen and posting videos of people is totally fucked up. You know how easy it is to hurt somebody? To destroy their life? Are you proud of yourself? If you have any feelings left, you should think about your actions. Listen, I, I didn't... Of course you did. You're so insecure, you can't even be happy with your own talent. You have to try and bring everybody down to your mean and ugly level. Okay, I do not have to listen to this bullshit. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? Well, it looks like you already did, Victoria. Then, I guess I'm done talking. I sure hope so. I'm not going to say I didn't enjoy that, but why? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh... That was easy. No. It wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh... I, I can't preach, <laughs> but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be... innocent. Or guilty. Uh... Well... Thanks for the photo, and 
Maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. That's still the same. That's still the same. Oh my god, that's different. Yeah, boy! <laughs> Oh, they found Rachel. Nice. Awesome. Fuck you, Victoria. She's alive. Yay. Okay, Jefferson. Here's my <coughs> fucking photo for the contest. Yep. And we live happily ever after, but we still have to worry about the apocalypse. Whoa. Yes. Yes, yes, yay. Yes. Okay. You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. Why is it still blurry out there? I hope I did everything right this time. Good work, David. Mm-hmm. Chloe. Oh, you're alive. Oh, you're alive. I did it. I fixed everything. Well, sir. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time. I've never... We were innocent. I've never been on a plane with those little screens. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited, too. We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so excited, too. It's so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. I can't wait to land in Frisco. Uh, nobody calls it Frisco, so please don't. <laughs> I have to admit, I love being called an artist. I can never get used to being on a fucking plane. I'm not afraid of it, it's just fucking, it's all nose and noisy and shit. Let's see, ten across, six letters, blue. How the hell am I supposed to- The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Yeah, boy! Just to figure that out. Please fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airlines... We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so excited too. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. You Just weren't. a bit. I didn't even hear it's you. It's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, 
Things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco, but we all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. <coughs> You're bleeding. Oh, Christ. Another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. Awesome. San Francisco is so cool, and this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Can I more a murderer, room? man? I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. <laughs> After this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm gonna eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. The guys are wondering about Mr. Wow, Jefferson. Sir, Max. The gas mask society you broke in and took him and took him. I went from the dark room to this gallery. I've been through so many realities in one week. Life is... weird. Like I said, the Gas Mask Society has Mr. Jefferson. Right now, we're attaching um, electric uh, wires to his nutsack. He will learn never to do them things again. I would love to have this on a shelf. Someday. That one is kind of silly. <sighs> I call that the nutsack hanging low. I don't know what the fuck I'm... I don't know what the fuck I'm looking for. Like, I do not understand art. You understand this dick? How much oh! would you Vibe. Me too. Makes me want to go buy an instant camera. Damn, I bet that film costs a fortune. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least for today.
Again, that terrifies the absolute shit out of me. Chloe! Hey, are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. Your I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. High altitude. <coughs> oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, come on. Please answer. What? Oh no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm Chloe! Like... Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Oh my god. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is gonna be destroyed. It's gone, dude! There has to be a way to stop this. For good. Your art. You have to go to your art and focus on it. How much would you pay for that? Damn, that's a nosebleed, though. What is going on now? It feels like reality is breaking apart. You're using it too much. What am I doing to time? I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. Can I, can I check? Eat shit and die. Fuck you. Fuck you. Good answer. Good answer. Hey, your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now, too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He you burned my diary. Always. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something... weird going on with you. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh, Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. 
the loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Please. Don't do this. I promise, this final dose won't hurt. What? Oh! Oh! Oh shit! Oh, I can still go back in time. Motherfucker got knocked the fuck out. What a veteran. David, watch out. How? How did you know that? Do something different. <sighs> Jesus Christ. What? David, watch out. Time to shut the fuck up, okay? David, watch out. Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Jesus Christ. What do I do? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Nope. <coughs> <coughs> I promise you, no more nosebleed. Wait, hold on. Can I... Can I please ask you for one last... request? Oh. You got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Some water? Some water? Uh, excuse me, but my, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. Anything? I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? How fucked up is that? <coughs> Something that will buy me enough time. I need that. Turn off the lights. And would you mind turning off the lights? They make me squint, so I won't look good for the shot. Now, you're thinking like a real photographer. And I don't want your last memory to be bad lighting. This won't do it. I have a feeling this won't do it. What was the other option? I think I saw an option that said play music. Yeah, play some music. Could he please at least play some music? 
So I can drift away? Even at the end, you're still a dreamer, Max. That's a nice trait. picture would you uh, take one last picture of me I I want to be your best subject I almost <coughs> don't believe that but I think you finally learned from me I don't know what the fuck <laughs> oh great Great. Anything? Come on now. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. Eh. Uh. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? What the fuck am I missing? Come on! David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Get the camera next to you! Nice! No gun. No balls. Jefferson, it's over! You are not going to stop me! To stop. He's hiding a gun over there. Oh, oh. Sorry, Madsen. He's it's hiding a gun over, over there. Not it. It's Grab over. Your gun now. Got it. Not it. It's over. Grab that bottle. <laughs> Over. Grab that bottle. Don't just stand there. Over. You are not going to stop me. Nice. Knock his ass out. Yeah. Oh Lord, man. <coughs> are you okay? Are you all right? Can you move? Yes. Ow. Thank you, David. <coughs> Thank you. No thing, me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. <gasps> nice. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. We need that kind of person in the Except gas mask society. Prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson, now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save <coughs> Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Jesus. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson, but you won't need this anymore. Good God. It's a studio. I better go outside Hold and call on, Warren. <coughs> Please answer. So, where is Chloe? I have no idea. 
hide the truth, tell the truth. Oh, t uh, of course I'm gonna tell the truth. David, uh, Chloe is, is dead. This isn't happening. It can't. No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you are you sure? Are you Yes, I I saw her. I I saw a Jefferson killer in the junkyard. Last night. Last night? When I was so close to finding out the truth? I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I God damn it! <coughs> you killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! David, wait! Eh, I don't care. Yeah. Max. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. Where's the bullet hole? What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. I... Chloe. I'm sorry. Joyce. I failed you. My family. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max. You better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. <coughs> Damn David, right. Thank you for saving me. Son of a bitch deserved to die. But a whole lot of years of prison rape would have been better. Dude, I am so twisted and fucked up. <coughs> My Chloe. Oh, d dude. I am so sad now. No, no, no. no. It's, it's screwed. If I am if I am going to go back in time, I mean, I may as well not even Bitch, that ain't freedom. Yes. <coughs> Warren, can you hear me? <coughs> Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah. Well, why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. <coughs> Where are you? I'm at the Two Wheels Diner. Trapped in here with Joyce thinks this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. We can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. I don't think the storm is getting smaller. I'm kind of scared. That's okay. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Whoa. I love that. Boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. <coughs> I kind of feel shitty for telling him Chloe's dead, but hey, I can't, I can't do that to that man. I told you, I trust you. 
us limbo have been warning you people for years that our culture of sin and entitlement would lead to God striking us down. And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now, God damn it, how do I pay all those taxes? You have one new message. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Who that? It's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I, I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. I'm sorry. You guys saw Tornado 2, right? Holy fuck. Jesus. For fuck's sake, I have to help this dude. <coughs> Kevin, did you see that tornado? Get the hell out of here! Max, there's no way I can pass up these images. Just look at it! You can't take a picture when you're dead. Now move your ass. Okay, if you insist. <coughs> oh, Max, you do know things. You're such an idiot. Only if you don't find the safe spot to take the logo. Okay? Now I better listen to a real everyday hero. Come with me. I have to help somebody else first. Out there. Hey, man! Please! Somebody! Anybody! I'm coming! Help me! Jesus! The gas man society can't can't get there in time. Is that a whale? What the fuck? That's a whale. <coughs> the gas man society couldn't help these people. How can I get out of here? 
I don't know. Oh, I, I, I got the, I got this. I got this. Watch. Go boom. I died in this room. I can't. Come on, you have to get out of here right now. I need to breathe. I need air. Storms. Ah. You should get out of here. The whole town is dying. Okay. I better hurry to the diner over there. I need Warren's photo. off. Now I have to find another way into the diner. Look at that. This tornado might be the end of the world, but not if I can change it. Evacuation. Once again, this is not a test. This is not a test. An E6 tornado warning has been issued for Arcadia Bay and surrounding How are you going to change it? Every time you go back and pa to the past, every the same thing happens. Oh, Max. <coughs> oh, Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? Two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's going to make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out I know. there. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce. But it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. So Hello. glad everybody is safe here. But I need that photo from Warren to help Chloe. Sorry. Sorry. I hate to say I'm glad to see you. But I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And... I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh, yeah. You're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. 
I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? I have to go back in time. Jefferson already killed Chloe. My mouth not I can't moving. Let that happen. The hell? I have to do something, Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. All because, because of how me. do you know that? I went how? back. I went back in I'm time. I'm a scientist, even though I play one at school. But this seems like pure cause and effect. <coughs> Maybe chaos theory. <sighs> What happened with Jefferson? Did, did he hurt you? Nathan accidentally killed Rachel Amber trying to impress Jefferson. Mental help. Now they're both dead. Jesus, Max. I want the whole story, but I guess we really are out of time. But I can still change things. What do you think will happen? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or, or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. How, How do, do you know you? that? All this destruction is my fault. Give me a break. You sure the hell didn't give yourself time travel powers? I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. And I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you. So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. <coughs> seem to escape hey be careful out there for luck just in case we don't get out of this I wanted to say I know Warren of course you do I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. For this shit. Come on, Max. Ugh. Chloe! Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. <coughs> no worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna sorry, we we're in. To Rachel. Let's go. Now. Chloe, wait! Listen! I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once! Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. 
and others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit! Nathan is the fucking serial killer! We saw the proof! Now excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead. Nathan is dead. And you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. I understand why you don't want to do this, and I won't blame you for not coming with me. Chloe! Chloe knows I have this power. She has to believe me now. Excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead. That fucker... Be Will you please... Chloe... Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm... I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up. I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And... You, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you... You asked me to end your life. I did. For you, I... I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. <coughs> that must have been... It must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's... That's why you should come with me, so we can stay together. And stay alive. I hear you, Max, but... Do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us, and he can actually stop him. Right? Is that why you stuck up for him? Because you think he can help us, really? David saved me! Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now.
Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. <coughs> nice. <coughs> Awesome. Jesus, the tornado's still going. Oh, Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked, actually worked. You're with me again. Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. But I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. A whale. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes. Fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Oh, wait, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Ugh. I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Is this stop beating yourself up, okay? We both paid our dues already on it. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Holy shit, man. This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. God. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on. Chloe. I've got your back, Max. Okay, my controller's gonna get charge. Alfred Hitchcock famously called film <coughs> "little pieces of time." I I'm back in class. What the hell? Pieces. These pieces of time can frame us in our glory and our sorrow. Have to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. This the might be hell. Now. Can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the human condition up. in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller? Diane Arbus. Be calm and go, don't Bueller. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Well, what is that? What the fuck? What is that? Totally what, the fuck? what the fuck? What the fuck? She saw humanity as tortured. Right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? Keep that to yourself. What the fuck? Seriously, though. I could frame what the fuck? Dark what the fuck? Moment of desperation. What the fuck? Everybody's <coughs> gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? Yeah. This doesn't make sense. Yeah, it seems like it. I fucked up everything. Oh boy. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't uh, even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. God damn it! Even when you're not here and I want to leave, you're always there. I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. 
Your purity inspires me so much, and we could be so happy together. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? There's no way I'm saying that. No way. Know. My selfies are shit. Thanks for ki- What the fuck? These are all fucked up! What the fuck do I say? I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna fucking bang my controller. I've been dreaming of the day when you would finally tell me. I love I you, pick? Mr. Jefferson. No, not that! I'm the worst one! We need to play catch up on all the time. <laughs> Wasted. I Especially grabbed the bottom part of my hand and I smashed it against the life. buttons and it first triangle. I love you too, Max. <laughs> Why? <coughs> no. This can't be real. <coughs> I don't believe it. No. Now what the fuck is this shit? Wait, Kate? Hey, Kate. Max, why did you stop me from jumping? What kind of friend are you? You what? never understood me, or what happened to me. Now my family will never leave me alone, and that means I'll always be alone. Thanks hey, that to you. Kate, that's not true. I've always been your friend. No! <laughs> what? Hey. What the fuck? There's a lot of here. Find it now. Is there another key around here? Kate, no! I know none of this is real, but she was my best friend! What the fuck? Well, you can look for the key. Okay. What key? This hall never ends. I, I better find something. I found keys. Give me back my keys, bitch. Oh shit, there's a dead whale out there. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Black Hole. Thank you, Step Crick. I go back in time, for, but for what reason? <coughs> what? Um, Rachel Amber, she was my angel. After my dad died and we moved, I felt abandoned. Rachel changed my life. 
So Rachel took my place. I'm glad she was there for you. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to tell you she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. Rachel, Rachel, why the fuck were you wearing a bracelet? Calm yourself, alright? Everything's here. <coughs> Do you what? think that Rachel and I would have been friends? Oh no. You suck, Victoria. Rachel is a whore. Because of her images of hopeless faces. We feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. I don't want to play as this whore. Uncalled for, but I don't care. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she has fun. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you said it's on record on video. Victoria Chase. No! Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Can I get out? Did you think we were best friends forever or something? I don't want to be here. What the fuck is going on? This is hurting my brain. Yeah, water in my cashmere. You know how much this fucking house could cost? Victoria's room has to be nearby. Oh, am I going to her room? Oh, look. No. It's not called, you know. It's selfie hair with black What the fuck is going on? What the fuck? So you should be here, he should be able to be a bit We were living club. Ah, not in the evil, not in the ivory, it's not really in the evil. Surprisingly, that's an actual app. <laughs> to talk backwards. The Ilpon Point never skimmed the easy of my robes up. We're having our next series, you know. Oh god, even Max is talking backwards. What if I turn the music up and it's just backwards? Hold on, let's let's try that. No, it doesn't seem like it. <coughs> oh my god, even the words are fucking backwards. What the fuck? Oh, man, they help me. I don't know. Missing person poster. It's the deer. Get back here, deer. No. That's all I hear. <coughs> Don't oh. try to hide, Max. Get over here. Let me capture you. Oh, God, no. Jefferson is coming after me, again. Max. No. You used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die.
Please understand, Max. The only place I can be my selfie is in the dark room. Oh, shit. I can't believe you let that hillbilly murder me in cold blood. Maybe I'll be safe in the lighthouse. What? Yeah, maybe I'll wake up. Your spark, Max. I thought I could be your professor for life. <laughs> oh my god, that was so fucking close. <coughs> I realize now you'll never be an artist, much less a photographer. Come here, Max. Class is dismissed. Something wrong here. Oh god. I miss those days when you looked at me in class with those wide eyes. I want to be your professor again. I can teach you so much. Good evening, Blackwell. This is Principal Wells. And I'm here to drop the mic on Max Caulfield. Max? It's Caulfield. <laughs> Attention. Max, where are you? Max, come out to play. Who is that? Come out to play. Oh, that's that guy. Oh, shit. Hey, babe, babe. Who wants to go, ape? Go, ape, go, ape, babe, babe. You can't just show up at Blackwell in a wheelchair and think we're going to accommodate her every whip. hungry. You dig my wheels, Max? Get in the car. I'll take you I for wish a I ride. Could press a button and blow the Get in the car. Get in the car. I'm not moving Max, I found I out who went through my files. You can run, but you can't I'll sick hide David Madsen on their ass. Come over here, young Max. You're my spirit man. Admit it. If only Kate Marsh would have jumped off that roof. Could blame Miss Caulfield and finally get her kicked out of Blackwell. You can't escape She's my surveillance, intro. Missy. She's a loser just like you, Max. And you can't keep saving her over and over and over. You thought I was harassing Kate, but I was helping her. What the hell did you Damn do? Damn it, Max. Wake up. I knew I should have given that scholarship to Victoria instead of Max. You're such a... I may be a dick, but at least I'm on Get your bony ass over here. I'm gonna cut you open, freak. Max. Bony ass over here. I'm gonna cut you open. Max. Comedy, gold, genius. Nobody ever helped me, Max. Oh my god. I didn't talk throughout that entire thing because I was concentrating. <coughs> Sit. <coughs> Get up. Get up. Oh god. Oh, what other fucked up hell is gonna happen now? Am I in a snow globe? Oh my god, I am. Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am. When your mom is away, I'll let her know that. Making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two wheel. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get close. 
groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Excuse me, ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us you to reach. You are ridiculous. Upon. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys. Oh, Jesus. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Huh. <laughs> Aha. You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine to Hey Max, would you say hi to Chloe and Choice? Don't forget to remind me to remind them that you let me die. What the fuck? Oh. <coughs> what the fuck, man? This is some fucked up shit. Am I now? How long will this nightmare go on? I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh Christ, I know. And she never shuts up. Does she? What kind of fucked up I'm special so hair? Bullshit. I think what everyone kind of fucked up is special a hell am I in? Let's prove it. Holy shit, Warren. Max is trying to play us both. I guess she's not as innocent as she acts. Not when she's trying to hook up with both of us. I only want to go ape with you, Chloe. Come here. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I hear that. None of this is true. Want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. Oh shit! Look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch, or take a selfie. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria, you're a real woman, not a little girl like Max. I fucking love what your tats, the, Chloe. What? You're so hot. I don't understand I what the fuck is going so on anymore. <coughs> is this going anywhere? Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Ra so I can use rewind. Them. Rachel's dead, and you're still alive. Life is so not fair. I wish she would have never come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. <coughs> what the fuck is going on? I'll be so grateful if this is the last digicode. Oh. Great. Numbers are all over the place. <coughs> How will I find the right code? Oh my god, I actually have Why to enter something. Why doesn't the mirror reflect any of the numbers? Ah. So there's only one right number here. Zero three one one. Nice. Don't kill us, Max. 
I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. Honey, I always thought of you like a daughter. And now you're gonna take me away from my family. Why would you do that? Max, you're exactly <coughs> the kind of soldier I'd want by my side in a war. Son of a bitch, this is gonna hurt. Oh my god. So this is how Max gets her revenge on. Honey, I always kill So this is how Max gets her revenge on. And now you're gonna take me Max, to the break her break. Max for saying don't make the squirrels die. You'll have to go without me. Please, Max, don't kill me. You've always had my back. I don't have now you're going to let me die. Who Who are you? Holy shit, are you cereal? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers? I tried to help. I tried to help. I only <coughs> wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. And once you got these no. amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you'd give a rat's ass. I do. I do care. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? <laughs> you were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's not true. I have great friends. And I've used my powers for good. I don't know Please, what the fuck is going stop on anymore. Please, being innocent. You're a goddamn <coughs> You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That Fuck was you. not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? We all are. We all are. This isn't about Chloe. Or even me anymore. Gosh, <coughs> you're so selfless now, Mahatma Max. It's too bad you pissed your power away on high school drama. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. But you didn't do that homework, so you'll have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she's our friend? That she respects us in any way? Yes. Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh hell, speak of the devil. Dude, do not even fuck with her head! She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't! There's no way you can break up our team! This is reality! What the fuck? After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. So tiny. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so <coughs> sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. <sighs> Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. Shake that bony white ass. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. 
I miss her, Max. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? Or a storm is coming? Max, start from the <coughs> beginning. Tell me everything. Let's talk about your superpower. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing any Epic. of this. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. Max, you better come check out these files. Cowabunga! Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze. Go to bomb! I double dare you. Kiss me now. Damn. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. I can't see a damn Dude, thing. Where's the path? Weird hanging out with you again. I know. Whoa, awesome picture. Chloe, you're back. Kate wasn't the first. Rachel! Oh, Rachel, no, no, please not her! Chloe. <laughs> Come on, Max, we're almost there. Finally! Max! Max, can you hear me? Please say something, Chloe. I... I must have passed out. Oh, thank God. Don't you ever do that again, okay? I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. My storm! I caused this! I caused all of this! I changed fate and destiny so much that I actually did alter the course of everything! And all I really created was just death and destruction! You don't know that. <coughs> Fuck all of that, okay? You were given a power, you didn't ask for it, and you saved me! Which had to happen, all of this did! Except for what happened to Rachel. Sorry about that. But without your power, we wouldn't have found her! Okay, so you're not the goddamn Time Master, but you're Maxine Caulfield. And you're amazing. So what does going back in time do? No matter what you do, the same thing is going to happen again and again and again because the first time you used your power. Max. <coughs> This is the only way. We don't know this! I feel like I took the shot a thousand years ago. We don't know this will work! You... You could use that photo to change everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to... To... Fuck that. No. No way. You are my number one priority now. You are all that matters to me. I know. You prove that over and over again. Even though I don't deserve it. I'm so selfish. Not like my mom. Look what she had to give up and live through. And she did. <coughs> she deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my... My step... Father deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. Don't say that. I won't trade you. You're not we... trading me. Maybe we don't know. You've just been delaying my real destiny. <coughs> Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died around you. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. I know I've been selfish, but for once. I think I should accept my fate. Our fate, Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week, and you did nothing but show me your love and friendship. 
You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. Wherever I end up after this, in whatever reality, all those moments between us were real. And they'll always be ours. No matter what you choose, I know you'll make the right decision. Chloe, I can't make this choice. No, Max. You're the only one who can. I'm I'm not going to I'm not going to sacrifice Chloe because I really don't know what the outcome is because we went back in time over and over and over again and the same thing still happens the storm still comes that's what she said but hey for fuck's sake, no matter what we do, the same reaction's going to happen. I am so sorry, I'm going to have to sacrifice Arcadia Bay. I know you guys are going to hate me, but hey, it's not the only game I made fucking terrible choices in, but hey, fuck it. <coughs> Max, it's time. Not me. Always be with you. Forever. Hey, I don't know. It's just a theory of mine, but I don't know. Fucking. It. <coughs> we went back in time so many goddamn times. Nothing. The same thing happens over and over and over again. The building's going in there. I don't know, but it's just a theory of mine. We went back in time by looking at pictures over, 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 and over again. <coughs> the same thing always happens at, at the end. The same thing always happens at the end. Like, if I sacrifice Chloe, what's, what's going to be the difference? The tornado is still going to come and it's still going to fuck Arcadia. We don't know. <coughs> Arcadia's still gonna get fucked in the end anyway. I know I made the most terrible choice ever. To a game that I have no idea what both endings are. But my theory at the end of the day is fucking, I believe, that the same thing was going to happen. <coughs> I, w I wouldn't have destroyed that picture. She can always go back in time. She has a picture before that shit. She could just use whatever picture to go back in time and tell Chloe to tell Max not to rip that picture and then save everybody. <coughs> Which, I believe the fucking ending anyway is still gonna get fucked. I'm gonna have to move somewhere where that is dense forest in the future. <coughs> a small town, a town, you know, where everything is quiet. Well, that's the end of episode five. 
I probably made the fucking worst choice, but my theory again is if I go back in time and Chloe dies anyway, the storm is still gonna come. That's that's my theory. Fucking I know I'm gonna get at least one comment saying you fucking idiot. But hey, you know, if you guys enjoyed it, leave a like, comment what should we do next, and subscribe. Hold on. Anything at the end here? Nothing? You decided? Holy shit, it was a close call. Like, it was a close call. I, I was in the minority of the people here. You decided to sacrifice Arcadia Bay. 47% of players did that. You decided to sacrifice Chloe. 53% of players did that. David killed Jefferson. 45. What is that? 97. David got a scar during the fight. David didn't get a scar during the fight. You can actually do that? Wow. <coughs> save the trucker. Didn't. You didn't save Alyssa. I didn't even see Alyssa. I didn't even know where she was. You saved Fisherman. You didn't change Joyce's mind about David. You told the truth about Rachel to Frank. You didn't let tell the truth about Rachel to Frank. Oh shit. Shit probably should have told him that. You kissed Warren. Yeah, a lot of players did that. <coughs> Alright. Well, that was the end there. If you guys, like I said, if you guys enjoyed it and shit, uh, yeah, do all that shit. Can I hear some whales? It'd be awesome if, if this was like after the tornado, how fucked up things were. But, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.